We're back. We're live. We're here. Think Tech Hawaii. Community Matters on a given Wednesday. Big day for us. Middle of the week. Lots of shows, like seven or eight shows today. This is a big day. And we have something special on Community Matters today. Uh, we're we're going to talk about uh, careers in event management. We have two people who are engaged up to their eyeballs in that subject. Uh, let me introduce them. One is Antonio Trancan, uh, and he is with You Can, can Event, event. And, and the website for that is YouCanEvent.com. Welcome exactly. to the show, Antonio. Exactly. Thank you so much for having me. And his, uh, and his affiliate, I guess, uh, and that's Rachel Sipes. Rachel Sipes is uh, an account uh, uh, executive, an account specialist, uh, a, 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 an event Management spe event production specialist, yeah. Yeah, yeah. For I'm another company, <laughs> which is related, and that's called. Uh, let's see, what is it called? Gourmet Events Hawaii. Gourmet Events Hawaii. So, welcome to the show, Rachel. Thank you. So, let's find out about you guys, Antonio. What's the deal with YouCanEvent.com? So, basically, when do you want to do an event? You need to find all the vendors for your event. And basically, on our platform, you can get in touch with vendors and event agencies like Gourmet Events Hawaii. And you can send your request saying, I want to do an event in Honolulu next July 30. And I will need catering, entertainers, and a venue. And people like Rachel from Gourmet Events Hawaii will answer back uh, to the requ request of our customers. And the event is set up online. So you're the broker. Yeah, exactly. You, you find uh, the, the, exactly. the people who need the event, and you find people like Rachel who will actually produce the event for exactly. you. Exactly. I'm the person that gathers everything. Okay, where are you headquartered? Uh, currently, we are uh, between Honolulu and the Bay Area, San Francisco. Ah, okay, okay. Yeah. How long have you been in business? So, uh, we started this entrepreneurial journey uh, in February 2015. Uh, with this concept of You Can Event as a brand, uh, we started in August 2016. So. Uh, we are in the market about two years. Oh, okay. okay. So uh, what's your special sauce? Why, why should I come to you instead of yeah. coming to someone else? First, you get budgets in less than 24 hours. So uh, that's the thing that... <laughs> that that means Rachel is, responds to you right away. Huh? Yeah, yeah. You but, ask her and she's on yeah. it. And then uh, we, we offer to all of our customers two things. One, a dedicated event coordinator, like a person like Rachel, that will help our customers. And second, we provide insurance for all of our customers that if something is not accordingly to the deal negotiated with the vendor, or for example, if we have any problem with the weather, we can reimburse our our customers oh, with 100% okay. money back guarantee. Oh, interesting, interesting. Yeah. So that's not insurance for slip and fall or anything, or no, liability no, no. insurance. That's insurance that the event goes off as planned. Exactly. Hard to write that kind of insurance. Uh, like, do you have an insurance company? You do it yourself. Yeah, no, we are working with the best uh, uh, event insurance in the world. They work with Rock in Rio, a lot of big uh, um, festivals in the world. So we are covered and we have 100% liability. Okay, well, what's an event? Sorry? What is an event? Uh, I'll ask you this question yeah, too, Rachel. <laughs> for me, is, 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 is the gathering of the best emotions in the world. So Promotion of what? Emotions, emotions. Emotions? Yeah, emotions. Okay, so is, is it music? Is it something with a stage and a crowd? I think uh, Is it a luncheon program? What is it? Like I said, event is a, a gathering. So Any be, gathering would be, be everything. Event. Yeah, I, I believe also that in the future, uh, despite of the technology and the revolution that we are uh, uh, facing, I believe that in the future, all of us as human beings, we will gather through events and we will build the future of the mankind through events. Aren't you worried that the internet will take, take the place of events and that people won't want to see each other face to face uh, anymore? No, because I, I know like we human beings, we have like two sides of, of, of our brain, you know, like we have one side that we are disruptive and we want evolution and create and innovate but at the same point we want to keep things rational and, and analytical in the point that we can ensure the nature and, and the, the natural behavior of the humans. Mm. So I believe that the events, the personal touch, the physical uh, engagement will be all this. Okay, does, does uh, Event Can Hawaii um, actually participate in the, in the design of the event or you leave that to Rachel? Uh, so we are an online scalable business, so we leave that to, to Rachel. Yeah, okay. That's where I come in. Rachel, okay, you're, you're in. Yeah. <laughs> Here you are. Okay, and Antonio calls you, he says, Rachel, I need this big event or small event, whatever. I mean, what kind of events do you do? Uh, we do everything. Uh, it varies from 
a small dinner party at a private home all the way up to big festivals, uh, Spam Jam. Um, we do um, weddings, uh, client appreciation parties, everything, anything. Okay, it could be little, it. it could be big. Exactly. Okay, and uh, you, you do them for local as well as um, mainland companies that want to do an event here that, that have a, a unit here, a branch here, or are just coming for a gathering of some kind. Yeah, do all of that. We do all of it. So we've got a, a great base of local clients that we work with on a regular basis on uh, all major Hawaiian islands. So we can do events on the Big Island, Kauai, Maui, and Oahu, and we also have uh, clients that come from all over the country and the world, even, and and rely on us to plan their dinner or. Uh, their incentive trip for reaching sales targets or, you know, whatever it might so it's, be. It's business mostly, huh? It's business uh, organizations. I mean, do you ever do it for government? Do you do it for academia? Do you do it for scientists? A lot of events at the convention center, for example, where thousands of scientists get together. Is that in your ambit? Yeah, actually, thank you for bringing that up. It is. Uh, part of one of the things that makes Gourmet Events Hawaii so unique and uh, important in Hawaii is in addition to that, we are also a staffing agency, staffing by GEH. So we employ over 700 people on the various islands to work for us to be our hospitality professionals and serve people at the events. Ah, so we waiters, waitresses. Waiters, waitresses, bartenders, event managers, food runners, chef assistants, all of it. So oh. we train them and then they serve, they provide great service. So when you go to an event at the Hawaii Convention Center, you're being served by staffing by GEH. Oh, okay, so okay. Those well, that's are, good because they can't keep the staff themselves. They don't have that, that kind of regular business where they can keep the staff online. You provide them the staff for your event. Yeah. For their event, even. For their event. Yeah, so every so event you, you, you at the Hawaii Convention Center is staffed by staffing by GEH. Okay, so yeah. you can give them a package with just the staff or more. I mean, what kind of packages do you give them? Do you say, look, I'm coming in, I'm going to do the event, I'm going to go on the line, I'm going to have these guys, these scientists, whatever it is, come in and I will handle it. And you can lease the space to me and I'll run it. Or do you just provide the staff for them or somebody else to run it? Well, that's the, the great thing about Gourmet Events Way and also You Can Events is you can pick and choose like your shopping on what parts you want us to have responsibility for or for booking. So if you want us to handle everything from helping select a venue all the way down to um, the flowers on the table, you know, all those little details, we can do that. But if you want to handle any of that yourself, uh, you can do that as well. We're Completely here to scalable. Yeah, we're here to help out where we can, um, yeah. advise where we can, and take it from there. Yeah, okay. So, um, um, Antonio said that you, you gave him uh, uh, an estimate, I guess, a proposal, whatever. Yeah. When he asks, he gives you certain parameters, you give him the estimate. Who determines the money here? In other words, A, how much does it cost me? Um, to have my event, and B, do I pay you, do I pay Antonio, and who so decides the price? Yeah, so basically we work as a hub for all the community, event planners, vendors, and brands that want to do events. So the, the, the payment is done to you can Event Platform, and we just uh, charge a small fee for every service sold. For example, You're just getting a percentage. Yeah, just a percentage. But the price itself, Rachel establishes yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, it's Rachel yeah. that defines everything. Rachel can define like uh, payment milestones. This is a big innovation in the industry because a lot of times event agencies, they have a lot of problems receiving the payment from the companies. And uh, with this model, we, we uh, event agencies can define the milestone payments mm -hmm. and companies can pay the, those milestones easily on our website. So why Rachel will use us? because they have an insurance that with us they will get paid and at the same time brands they will use the tool to get in touch with with Rachel and everything is, is easy. While we're on it how do you get your customers? I mean you're trying to go national, yeah. you have a branch here, I guess here is a good place because there's a tourist industry uh, uh, which is large uh, and San Francisco because you're from San Francisco into the west coast and maybe the east coast too. Yeah. But how do you get your clientele? Yeah, so Right now, we are working with brands like Microsoft, Mary Kay, Primark, Pipedrive, a lot of big uh, worldwide brands. And basically, we do partnerships with those brands where we serve as the tool to organize events. So the companies, they are doing regularly events for their teams, for their customers, community, whatever. And they use you can event to get 
in real time budgets and vendors for their events. Okay. And second, of course, we go personally to events and uh, networking events, marketing events, and we do networking with potential customers and we close an average of one customer per three events. And <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Sales, man, sales. Yeah, 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 yeah. The, so, great, yeah, uh, the great thing about uh, companies like ours and partnerships like ours is people want to, to create great memories for their friends and families uh, through events. And sometimes you might not know everything that goes into building this great event. Or you might not know who to contact. And well, most people don't know. It. Yeah, we. They need a specialist, really. Yeah, exactly. And we partner with uh, dozens of great chefs on the island to create menus. Um, we have weeded out all the good, um, the great people to work with. You know, the best of the best, and that's who we go to 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 help uh, create this this event. And then on the day, you don't want to have to be checking in vendors when you're celebrating you know, your birthday, you don't want to have to be making sure things are going on time and that... Well, million details. Yeah. And, and so it's all about attention to detail. Exactly. And, and if I go to an event and I see there isn't attention to detail, I'm really turned off. I want to see detail. I want to see people caring about that. So you say uh, gourmet, okay? Gourmet suggests, I could be reaching here, food. Yeah. So are you focused on food? Well, we, who isn't focused on food? <laughs> we love it. Um, yeah, so we, we partner with a lot of great chefs uh, around the island, ranging in all different various budgets, depending on, on what it is you're looking for. Um, and I think just us individually as the team, we all love food. We, if, if we're hanging out as a group, we pick the best restaurant well, that we want to go to. Thinking about it, food, food is, is critical in any event. You it know, is, yes. You know, a gathering equals food, always. It's always, I mean, and in fact, the food defines the event because if the food is good, the event is good, <laughs> usually. And if it's bad, well, that's a problem. But, exactly. but, but query, I mean, you say gourmet events, you, you suggest that this isn't just ordinary, mm, you know, assembly line food, uh, you know, a, a nondescript buffet kind of food as you get in so many places. This is gourmet. How do you achieve that? Yeah, through uh, a few ways. Our partnerships with our chefs. So we, uh, we only work with chefs that we enjoy the food of. We would never produce an event or supply uh, something that we didn't full heartedly stand behind ourselves. So that's one way that we can guarantee it. And then the other was exactly what you said, the attention to detail. The little things that you can do to the way you display a food. Uh, the service of the food is another thing. You can have an amazing event that looks beautiful in the middle of a field. And if the service is bad and the food is bad, oh, sure. you have nothing. Sure. So yeah, you we, we've tried and tested it all and we we just put that flair behind everything to make sure it's executed perfectly. So, uh, but what about the other side, the content side? I mean, I just want to clarify that how much is this side and how much is that side. And for example, there was a big event, what, was it this past week uh, called Verge. Verge was an energy event, energy sustainability. The whole energy community goes down there and it was at the, uh, uh, say, the, the, the Hilton Hawaiian Village mm -hmm. and um, the ballroom, and well, many rooms. And um, there were probably, I know, I'm guessing, a thousand people there, I'm guessing. Um, and so there's a lot of panels and speeches and breakouts and sessions and working groups. I could go on. Um, would you be involved in that in the substantive side of organizing speakers, content, you know, the intellectual side of their presentations? Or would you leave that to some other organization? It depended on what the client wanted. If they wanted help with arranging all of that. We have experience in that. We produce a lot of seminars on the island, so we have a lot of experience on how to keep the audience engaged, good like good times for breaks. Uh, so we can we can handle all of that. Uh, we can advise on that if, if you don't want us to take that on fully, or um, so we can leave it to the client. Yeah. Have it your way. Have it your way. Yeah, yeah, not we, like Burger King, but have it your way. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> we step in and help out when uh, when we think we can offer advice or when the client is seeking advice or uh, we leave it to the client if it's something that they really want to handle. Mm. But the important thing is on the day of the event, uh, each of our event managers go fully prepared for any eventuality. We spend, there's a lot of time, a lot of sleepless nights, a lot of Excel spreadsheets that just plan out uh, what, what are we going to do if it rains? What are we going to do if the sound isn't working? What are we going to do if, you know, just all these different things so that we have our solutions ready 
when we show up to the event. Yeah, it's like that ad with Farmers Insurance. We've seen it all. Yeah. Yeah. Well, let's take a short break. Come back. I'm going to ask you how much it costs to do this, okay. right? Because that's really important. This is Community Matters. Uh, we have Antonio Trancon and uh, Rachel Sipes. We're talking about event production, event planning, the event planning industry in Hawaii and elsewhere. We'll be right back. You're watching Think Tech Hawaii, which streams live on thinktechhawaii.com, uploads to YouTube, and broadcasts on cable OC16 and Olelo 54. Great content for Hawaii from Think Tech. You're watching Think Tech Hawaii, 25 talk shows by 25 dedicated hosts every week, helping us to explore and understand the issues and events in and affecting our state. Great content for Hawaii from Think Tech. Some say scuba divers are the poor man's astronaut. At Dive Heart, we believe that to be true. We say forget the moon. Dive Heart can help children, adults, and veterans of all abilities escape gravity right here on Earth. Search DiveHeart.org and imagine the possible. Oh, yeah. Okay, we're back. I told you we'd come back, and we came back. This is Community Matters on Think Tech. We have Antonio Trancon. He's with you, YouCanEvent.com. She's a sort of broker in San Francisco and Hawaii. And Rachel Sipes, uh, she's uh, an account production specialist uh, in making events for Gourmet uh, Events Hawaii. Very interesting business, very interesting uh, operations. Way to spend your life, actually. Yeah. Right? You get to eat, right, at these events. Um, you look down and say, hi, I'm Rachel. I'm setting this up. How about some food? Right. I I wish, but I do get to uh, do some tastings with chefs on occasion. But on the actual day, it's not about me. I'm behind the scenes. It's about everyone else enjoying their yeah. food. Yeah, probably have trouble eating because you're attending to all those details. Yeah, exactly. You can't do both, really. you, you got to focus on one or the other. Yeah, <laughs> but, you know, we get to be a part of every, you know, it's usually a celebration That's when we're together. Care. So we get to be a part of making these amazing memories for people. Yeah, and you got to really invest yourself in that. You're going to be with them. You're going to be the heart of it. You're going to be the, you know, the designer, the the creative producer. Yeah. Is that what you do? I mean, you are actually producing these events. That's the the work of a, an account produce pro, produce production specialist. Yeah. Right? So event producer. Yeah. So it starts from an idea from the client or. Sometimes clients come to us with exactly every detail of what they want their event to be like. Yeah. And sometimes they come to us just saying, uh, I don't know, I, I need to have a dinner. <laughs> like, okay. And so uh, sometimes I love those ones more because that's when you you start from absolutely nothing and you just build. Sure. And well, that's your creative experience. Yeah. But what about the, the hyper neurotic person who comes to you and is worried about everything and wants to be, um, what do we call it, hands on compulsive? Uh, you need a little psychology to deal with that. I'm sure that happens, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. People take a lot of pride and ownership in what they do. So they want involvement and they want to make sure that everything is going to plan. And and sometimes that, they're wrong. Sometimes um, they don't know how to do it. Sometimes, yeah. yeah. But that's, that's why we're here as well. Um, because we, we can advise the client, um, but ultimately we're there to create the client's vision. And if we think that something might not go as well, we will be ready with a backup plan in case it in doesn't. Case, yeah, right, in case the client's plan doesn't pan out the way the client thought. Exactly. <laughs> we will be ready to step in before yeah. anybody even notices. Yeah, that's very that, important. That's, yeah. that's the kind of detail I'm talking about, you yep. know, sort of a, a completely thought out program. So, okay, for this service, uh, how much money? And I'll give you examples. I mean, make case study kind okay. of thing here. Okay. Okay. My law firm wants to have a party, and they want to invite 50 of their best clients and go to a good restaurant, have a nice meal. They want to do some speeches afterward, and they want to show a video. Um, and actually, they don't have a video. They want to show a video, but they don't have it yet. Okay. And they want this to be on, a, say, a Saturday evening, and uh, and it's it's not black tie, but it's, you know, it's business attire. Yeah. yeah. Um, and they want a good, good venue, good location, okay? What's that going to cost me if I give it to you to handle? Well, uh, you're going to just like my answer. Uh, so uh, is there a budget that I should be mindful of? Um, uh, no. Uh, I, I give you full, <laughs> full reign here. Yeah. Uh, I, and I trust you to give me a fair price. It is so difficult to to say because it depends on so many things are you going to eat is it going to be a buffet is it going to be plated service is well, there going to be i'll give you i'll answer those questions okay it's going to be service on a service, plate okay. plated how many courses um oh i'd say a, a, a full dinner uh, what does that mean um like three courses three courses let's say three courses yeah, yeah. And, and there'll be and there'll be wine and beer and 
and hard liquor for that matter. Okay, and do you want um, the best of the best chef on the island or do you want to have a great meal but maybe at a more affordable price? Well, probably I would say the latter. Okay, yeah. um, well, I would say that our events uh, range depending on all of those details, but they usually start around $65 a person uh, and they can go anywhere up um, to you know, $100, $200, $300 a person depending on your budget. Mm -hmm. but that's another. Is that including the food or is just your services? It, uh, no, that would be uh, including everything. So that would be your total for the event, including our services, the food, everything. Well, that's not too much more than what a hotel might charge me direct, is it? No, it's not. And the, the great thing is if you make that little bit of an investment to go outside of the hotel, you can have your event in some amazing places. Um, I've done events aboard the USS Missouri. Um, I've done events. Uh, on the beach in the North Shore, um, in the middle of a field, in the middle of the I island. like that one. That one appeals to me. Yeah. Do, do, you, do you include include the video or people taking uh, pictures and video and all that kind of, you know, memorialization of the event? Yeah, so we can. If that is something that uh, our client wants, we are more than happy to um, find a great photographer that fits into their budget. Um, what's so great about uh, companies like Gourmet Events of Hawaii and YouCanEvent.com is you, we work to your budget and if we can't meet your budget we'll be really honest uh, with that and say you know that that's not gonna um, quite be enough for our services but we can also help direct you or come up with a different solution mm. um, but you tell us the budget and it's our job to make something work into that. How long have you been in business here? Um, I've been in business, well, Gourmet Events Hawaii has been in business in Hawaii for over 12 years. Mm -hmm. um, it was started by our founder. She refers to herself as our chief festivities officer. Her name? At Kat Lynn Hertaviz. And she started on her own in the closet of her condo uh, about six years ago. <laughs> it's like the garage in the old days. I know, days, yeah. exactly. <laughs> um, she, yeah, so about six years ago, she hired her first employee, and the business has doubled every year since then. And we just... Uh, hired our first employee in uh, the Bay Area. So, oh, um, I see. Our staffing agency. Antonio, will help you with that? Yeah, yeah. we hope I, so. I had a meeting <laughs> with Kathleen yesterday, so we will collaborate on the Bay Area as well. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, I, you know, I, my own experience is very hard to find an event planner, and it's very hard to find an event planner that you can trust out of the box. And uh, I mean, I, I'm not including you because I haven't had any dealings with you, but. Uh, what I mean is you could find an event planner that somebody presents as an event planner and it could be a complete dud. Uh, and then you're really sorry because your 50 clients showed up and you're embarrassed. This is not so good. Yeah. yeah. Um, so how many event planners are there now in the state of Hawaii? What's your competition like? Um, you know, we do, we do have competition, especially uh, in the weddings market is one because well, so many weddings, there's, yeah. uh, everybody comes to Hawaii to get capital, married. Yeah. Exactly. So there is a lot of uh, wedding production companies and we do have some tough competition on the island but because we um, focus on the detail and we've got a really solid team that think about all of those eventualities and uh, our staffing agency that we train all of our staff uh, so that we know that we'll be providing great service those are the things that, that set us apart and and what builds our business. What's your level of satisfaction? I mean, what's, what's your track record? Can you talk about it? Yeah, so we send do, out... Do you ever do debriefing with your clients after? Do you ask them to review and rate you? Yeah, we do all the time. Um, we have, we send out a survey, so we do the net promoter score, NPS, and our score uh, is currently 86, which if you compare to some other uh, big companies in the world, uh, a great, uh, what's considered a great NPS score is about 75. Hmm. Uh, and we're so you're better than Yeah, a great we're score. currently at 86, which is okay. uh, really high for so How NPS. can I find you? I assume it's gourmet, uh, events Hawaii dot com, is that? gourmet events Hawaii dot com. I guess that, yeah. Yeah, good. that's okay. it. <laughs> okay. Well, let, let's turn to Antonio for a minute. Antonio, what do you think of Rachel? Uh, it's perfect because gourmet events Hawaii and Rachel can ensure the quality of the services How do you provided. know that? Because I already had a meeting. How did we, you select them? Because the, uh, I ca we can analyze with our background in events. So in they the already city. existed? Yeah. So and you found them? You were yeah. looking for somebody in yeah, Hawaii who you could with. trust to, yeah. to be part of your network? Exactly. How did you find them? Did you uh, look in the paper or what? So, no, like we, we have a team uh, on, our, on our offices, always looking fine for new vendors and partners. 
and gourmet events. So I came on Google and uh, we, we found them. Rachel, how much of your business comes from Antonio? Is it a lot or did you get you know, direct referrals here locally on, on the ground? Well, the great thing is uh, Antonio's business is just getting off the ground in Hawaii. So it's a new partnership and we're really looking forward to seeing how we can work together. Yeah. Exactly. And yeah, and he can promote you in the Bay Area. Mm. Yeah. 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 Watch out, San Francisco. So, Antonio, <laughs> tell me about your website and your technology, because that's going to be part of this year, dealing on a networking basis, yeah. and you have this mix and match yeah. menu affair, the way you set it so, up. How, how do you do that? Yeah, earlier you were saying that, okay, like if the budget doesn't match the need of the customer, uh, we will uh, suggest uh, someone. So that's the thing of our platform. So if you don't find... Uh, or if you are talking with an event planner like Rachel from Gourmet Events Hawaii, you can find another 10 or 30 uh, event agencies or vendors that might uh, fit you uh, on, on your request. So the thing of our software is that you send a request for our network saying, I want to do an event in Hawaii, and that network will get back with proposals to you saying... So I go on your website, I ask for... Uh, a proposal, yeah. and I answer questions, right? I'm yeah, it's just doing a, my menu it's thing. Just a simple form, yeah. Like, a simple form. Yeah, right? asking like the the vendors that you might need, like uh, entertainers or a venue or a catering, uh, and then that request is sent from our network, and they can get back to the customers on our website. Everything. Yeah, okay, so <clears throat> the answer comes back to me by somebody calling me, or is it an email? No, uh, chat on, on chat, our platform. Chat, okay. Yeah. And then w when you have enough uh, to talk to Rachel, I suppose the event is in Hawaii, uh, then you, know, you would call Rachel and get an estimate from her. Does uh, she get involved? No. Like, well, at what point does the client have direct dealings with no, Rachel? No, the, the, the client have a direct deal uh, since from the beginning with Rachel. So he just sent the request, and then the proposals is Rachel doing to the customer. Okay, so, so we, you're, we you're never actually engaged no, in that no, part no, of no, it. No, 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 no. You're just catching them. Exactly, you just uh, match. Presenting to yeah. Rachel. Put the things this way, like it's the same as Airbnb. So you as a customer, you find a room to stay and then the host get in touch with, uh, with yeah, the yeah. customer okay. easily. So, and, and Rachel, you, you can also take clientele on your website directly, right? Yeah. You, you, don't, you don't need to have every client come in through uh, event uh, can Hawaii or uh, what is it? You can event. You can event. Yeah, no, um, yeah, so people can contact us directly by phone uh, uh, through our website. We do get a lot of inquiries that way and through referrals. Uh, but what is so great about You Can Events is the whole future of everything is digitalized. It's more has a hub, you know, of entertainments yeah. and, and event because most of the times event agencies like they suffer a lot on, on this industry. They don't have time to generate leads or they don't have time like to deal uh, by email with customers. Everything I gets see. lost. As you said, it's hard for you as well to find event planners. So we make that easy. Okay, got it. Well, thank you, Antonio. And thank Antonio so uh, Trancon and Rachel Sipes, thank you so much for coming down and explaining the whole industry to us. And it sounds very interesting. And, you know, maybe in my elder years, I, I will get into the business. But at least uh, uh, I'd like to come to one of your events and eat the food, yeah? Yeah, definitely. <laughs> or let us throw you a party. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Thank you, Rachel. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> thank you. Thank Antonio. you so much. Thank you so much, Jay. Thank you. <laughs>